Here is the Shimano Dura Ace 11 speed chain. This model, the CNHG 901 11, comes with a quick link. It is a replacement chain for Dura Ace or XTR drivetrains, although you can use it with other Shimano. And to say other Shimano component group sets that are 11 speed. The quick link is non reusable and it looks like this is a product of Japan. I've decided to go with Dura Ace because the last chain I have has several thousand miles on it and shows very little wear. Uh, the shifting started to, I guess, get a little less snappy I would say so I ended up thinking I should replace it who knows if that's gonna do the trick or maybe I need to adjust my derailleurs even more but they are electronic DI2 and I've been using 11 speed chains with the DI2 and it's been working out very well okay let's see what we have in this Shimano chain Shouldn't be anything else in this box. No, the box is empty. Let's take a look on the back. And we have the quick link and a safety manual, technical reference. The main thing to note here is the installation of the chain, how the decals, well, not the decals, but the lettering is on the outside facing on the outside of the bike so you could see it. There's the chain, and make sure that you do not install it so that the non-marked side is displaying out. Here's a brief look at the marked side, and let me flip it over. And this side, there's no lettering or indications. So this side will face towards the inside of the bike. And this side with the lettering shall face the outside for proper insulation. With 116 links, it comes out to be 251.7 grams. I thought my other chain was a little lighter, like in the 230 grams. But that's 116 links, and now I have the additional quick link. Let me throw that on there to come out to. 254.1 grams. Let's see if I can slowly remove this. It's a little greasy. Okay, make sure it goes back to zero. All right, let's take a close look at this chain. As you notice there's holes between the in the links. I guess that's to shed a little weight. Nothing too spectacular, it's just a chain. But it is Shimano's top of the line 11 speed chain. We now make 12 speed group sets for the mountain bike. I believe XTR has a 12 speed. And I think they just came out with lower end group set 12 speed as well at the time of this video when I'm making it. It is a little oily. It came pre oiled or pre greased. I think I may still have to add lubricant to it after I install it. The safety information provided mainly applies to just the quick link. And I have installed another version, the XT version of this on another bike. And it was pretty difficult to get on. It's actually real tight, a lot tighter than I thought it would be. Compared to KMZ quick links, this is a lot harder to get on. And also this says that it's one use only, so I have not taken it off. I believe that if you once you put it on, Shimano wants you to either put on another one and throw out this old one because they said it's not reusable. I'm not sure if that's just to cover their bases to make sure it won't break or in case or that it would really really break. All right, let's check out this chain with my Park Tool Chain Checker CC-2. What I'm gonna do is stick them between two separate links here. And then when I push down, it moves. And let's take a look at the 
watching. All right, in the video, it's going to be hard to see. There's not enough light in there. It's real dim. But when I push this all the way down, it's at 0. Point, uh, let's see, about 0. 0.5. If I push a fair amount of pressure, it goes between 0. 0.5 and 0. 0.75. But when I let go, it evens out to 0. 0.5. Here it says a new chain is between 0. 0.25 and 0. 0.5. And replace at 0. 0.75. My other door is chain after a few thousand miles. It's at 0. 0.75. So it's a good thing I'm replacing the chain now so this chain I don't know the exact retail price but I think I got it for about 40 US dollars the Ultegra one that I've seen at stores was also around in the 30s $30 range so I figured might as well just go with the Durace one since I have a Durace 11 speed crank set so this would match very well with it well that's it for the 11 speed Dura Ace chain. This is everything that comes with the retail box of the Dura Ace 11 speed CNHD 901 11.